Hi, I'm Rhonda Buss and I'm going to walk you through a wonderful pattern. It's the Colette Clover Pant Pattern. When I got this pattern, I absolutely enjoyed it so much because it's just kind of a feast for the eyes. It has this lovely little stitching line on the side. It opens up like a book. Each of the pages flip, making it very easy to follow along as you work through the process of putting the pants together. And then something that I thought was really fun is in the back, there's a nice little envelope where you can store your pattern once it's all finished. And then you just close it with the tab in the back and nicely and neatly put it away. The Clover Pant Pattern, it's a straight leg pattern. It's rather fitted. One of the things that I was very happy about is how well it fit, but we'll get to that in our next video. Today I'd like to talk to you though about the type of fabric that you should choose to make the pant with. Here's one pair that I've made. It's a cotton lycra. I think it has maybe about 3% lycra mixed with the cotton. It's a great little summer pant. Now one thing I do want to tell you is the, the the pant is designed with pockets. It has two little pockets. I'll show you with the next pair. This particular pair, I decided to not put the pockets in. If you leave the pockets out, it gives a much flatter look across the stomach. The other pair I did, these are actually a pair of wool pants with Lycra. They fit, like I said, very nicely. These, I did put the pockets in. The pockets are great, especially if you're out shopping and you want a place to stick your cell phone, maybe a little bit of change or a couple of dollars. It's very nice, but you can see that that would add just a little bit of extra bulk to the front of your pants. So that's something that you can choose to add or not add, and we'll talk about the construction of that in a later video. As far as fabric choice is concerned, one of the things that I would do is, because of the fact that the pants should be made with a stretch, some fabric that has stretch to it, making the pants out of, a pair, out of muslin is not going to be such a great idea because you're not going to get the same fit that you'll get if you have fabric that has some lycra stretch to it. So my suggestion would be to buy a piece of fabric that is inexpensive or that you got on sale for a great price but has a lot of stretch to it. This is a stretch denim and you can see that it really stretches quite nicely. This would make for a great first muslin pair and, and if they fit the first time, fabulous, then you've got a great pair of pants. I showed you the, the wool version that I made. This also has stretch to it, but not nearly as much as the stretch denim does. So I, my suggestion would be to get something that has a really nice stretch, not a knit, but something with cotton and lycra, and then move on, once you get a good fit, then move on to a fabric that doesn't have as much stretch to it. Next, we're going to talk about how the pants fit.